At the end of the topic, you will be able to Calculate the volume, curved surface area and total surface area of a cone. Calculate the volume, curved surface area and total surface area of a frustum cone. Welcome to this topic on cones. The heap of sand, ice cream cones, birthday caps introduce us to the concept of cones in our daily life. Like in the case of cylinders, we need to know the methods of calculating the surface area and the volume of cones. Write circular cone. In this animation, you will learn about a right circular cone. Take a paper in the form of a circle with center O and of any convenient radius. Draw any two radii on it. Then cut the paper along the radii to obtain a sector. Now bring the two edges of the sector together so that they coincide. The figure formed is a cone. Here is an example of a cone. A cone has a plain circular end called the base of the cone. The point A is called the vertex of the cone and O is the center of the base of the cone. The line segment AO joining the vertex to the center of the base is called the axis of the cone. The length of this line segment AO is called the height H of the cone. The length of the line segment joining the vertex A to any point, say B, on the circular edge is called the slant height L of the cone. The size of any cone is usually specified by the radius of the base R and the height H. In a right circular cone, OAB is a right angled triangle. Therefore, L square is equal to R square plus H square or L is equal to the square root of R square plus H square. Cylindrical vessel and ice cream cones. A right circular cylinder having diameter 12 cm and height 15 cm is full of ice cream. The ice cream is to be filled in cones of height 12 cm and diameter 6 cm having a hemispherical shape on the top. Find the number of such cones which can be filled with ice cream. It is given that radius of the cylinder R is 6 cm and height of the cylinder H is 15 cm. The formula for calculating the volume of the cylinder is equal to pi r square h. On substituting the values of height and radius in the above formula, we get pi into 6 squared into 15 centimeter cube, which is equal to 540 into pi centimeter cube. Height of the ice cream cone h is equal to 12 centimeters. Radius of the ice cream cone R is equal to 3 cm. Therefore, the volume of the conical part of ice cream cone is equal to 1 divided by 3 into pi R squared H. On substituting the radius and height of the cone in the formula, we get 1 divided by 3 into pi into 3 squared into 12. This is equal to 36 pi centimeter cube. Now, the volume of the hemispherical top of the ice cream cone is calculated using the formula 2 divided by 3 into pi r cube. On substituting the value of r, we get 2 divided by 3 into pi into 3 cubes, which is equal to 18 pi centimeter cube. 
total volume of ice cream cone is equal to 36 pi plus 18 pi centimeter cube which is also equal to 54 pi centimeter cube. Therefore, the number of ice cream cones is equal to volume of the cylinder divided by the total volume of the ice cream cone which is equal to 540 pi divided by 54 pi. On simplification, we get 10. Let us now look at the principles. If the base radii of the two cones are equal, then volumes are in the ratio of their heights and curved surface areas are in the ratio of their slant heights. If the heights of the two cones are equal and base radii are R1 and R2, then ratio of radii is R1 is to R2 and ratio of their volumes is R1 square is to R2 square. Frustum is a three-dimensional figure obtained from a cone. When the cone is cut by a plane parallel to its base, two solids are obtained, a small cone and a frustum. The portion of the solid between the base and the plane cutting the cone is the frustum. Bucket, flower pot, drinking glass and lamp shades are examples of frustum from our daily life. In this topic, we have learned that the volume of a cone is 1 by 3 pi r square h cubic units. The curved surface area of a cone is pi r l square units, where l is equal to root of h square plus r square. The total surface area of the cone is pi r l plus r square units, where l is equal to root of h square plus r square. A frustum is the lower end of the three dimensional figure formed when a cone is cut by a plane parallel to its base, the volume of the frustum of a cone is equal to volume of the given cone minus the volume of the smaller cone.